two to your three, what growth are you looking to see in your game this season? More consistency. I think, you know, knowing what to expect every year, the game gets more comfortable, so just making sure that I'm contributing on a consistent basis. And then, how's the energy in the gym changed from last year? The energy is amazing, and uh, everyone's having a lot of fun, and I think everyone can feel that. Um, really good energy, everyone's just excited for the season, excited to play for each other. What was your USA basketball experience like? I know you guys came up short, but what do you take out of a, a unique experience like that one? Well, every time getting to represent the USA is an awesome opportunity. This one being, you know, one of the last tournaments before the Olympic um, Games. So, super exciting, and every time it's just, you learn a little bit more. Three on three is a different game than five on five, so getting the opportunity to play it, play with new players is awesome. What's that chemistry like? Like you're tagging in and out so often, yep. you're, the mismatches, like that's a different game within the game. Yeah, you end up learning each other's games very, very quickly. You're playing every position, guarding every type of player, so you really have to trust and rely on each other. And so we had a good few days of practice before that tournament, and we really, I thought, grew together very quickly. The versatility and the learning on the fly, how can you take that and apply it to this summer with a lot of new things? in addition to the ones that are already there. For sure, and I think reading each other offensively and defensively makes great teams. And there's a, you know, a good core of people and then adding great players in is awesome. And I think these few days, training camp, the next week and a half before we start actual games is huge for us just knowing what each other likes, knowing the process, knowing the cuts, um, knowing where each other are. It's huge. What are your impressions of Caitlin at this point? She's great. She's a great player, a great person. Um, Obviously very hard to defend, so she's bringing a great um, offensive game to the Fever, and just excited to see how she does this year. Um, Melissa talked yesterday about going from playing in a barn a couple years ago to now kind of having potential sellout crowds here. Just what is your impression of you know, coming from when you started here to now? The growth is very evident, and I think you know going back to the energy, everyone, not only the people in this gym, but the city of Indianapolis, the state of I the state of Indiana, is just so excited and so excited for us and the growth of the program. And um, I'm just excited to play in front of the fans because we've already seen and felt how excited they are to watch us. How tough is it to get right to games on Friday when you're barely in camp for like seven practices, right? It's a, it's a quick turnaround, and you know, every team in the league is going through the same thing, but we just have to make sure that we're focused this week and preparing for that day, and it, it comes quick, but we're ready for it. If anything, is it maybe a tune-up for all the back-to-backs that you guys will have? With oh. A quick turnaround, your, the rest of recovery like you were talking about? Yeah, you learn, you learn very quickly how to take care of your body, what your body needs, whether that's ice bath, hot tub, Norma teching, whatever it needs, you have to learn how to get ready for the next day because everything comes so quick.